Hey, it's Ed Salek. The show is Island Hop, and we thank you for watching. Now, we've been bringing you some of the greatest doo-wop sounds in the world. Tonight, we have the connoisseurs of doo-wop, Echoes of Time. In the chapel of Yeah.
Not a genius, nor do I want to be. I'm not perfect, as you can plainly see. So if you want me, take me as I am. Take me as I am. I know just how to treat you.
to me. Come 
magic moment So different and so new was like any other Until I kissed you And then it happened It took me by surprise I knew that you felt it too By that look in your eyes Sweeter than wine Softer than a summer night Everything I want I have Top, 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 top. And if your old man ain't treating you right, come up and see old Dan. I'll rock and roll him all night long. I'm a 60 minute man. Oh, yeah, I'm a 60 minute rock and roll him all night long. I'm a 60 minute man. Listen. 
this moment to be by your side. Best friend Ronan told me you had teardrops in your eyes. Daddy's home. Daddy's home to stay. Echoes of Time, you guys are great. And you really have a good sound, great harmony, good strong bass. I had to say that, Bill. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you later. Uh, Starting on the end, introduce yourself to the folks. My name is Joseph Morelli, and I live in Staten Island, New York. Yay! Hey, Staten Island. Yeah, Staten Island. Yeah, I'm Tony Gutierrez from uh, Jersey City, New Jersey. I'm Joe Cassidy. I'm from Bloomfield, New Jersey. I'm Bill Prawn from Parsippany, New Jersey. I'm Carlos Vasquez from Staten Island, New York. There's another Staten Island. God bless. Well, I tell you what, it's been a long time getting you guys here. It's a long story. The, we had the, the group book to come on, uh, well, I guess almost a year and a half, two years ago. Almost two years, two ago. years, two years ago. ago. Yeah, almost two years ago. Uh, Bill and I were working on and you were coming down, and then the lead singer at that time got sick. Subsequently, he passed away, and uh, you know, we, we finally got you in here, and sorry to say under such sad circumstances, but I'm glad to have you here anyway, because you Thank guys you. are great. great you really here. are. Thank you. Thank you. Joe, how does somebody get in touch with Echoes of Time? Well, you can actually you can get in touch uh, with Bill, okay. his number. Yeah. Uh, we're on Facebook, actually, and uh, uh, you can see uh, you know what's going on with us, and we also uh, got a website that Warren to Sorrow built for us, and uh, it's uh, theechoesoftime.com. And uh, just uh, drop us a note what you want you want us to come and do a gig with you, or any questions you have for us, just drop us a line. Hmm. Um, well, let's start with you, Joel. Let's start okay. Again. Uh, your influences in music, the other groups that you sing with, and uh, who you've been with? Yeah, well, I, like I said, I started when I was 17, and I sang at the Lowe's Oriental in Brooklyn, by the Lowe's Oriental in Brooklyn, with the Passions, the Mystics. They all started there. You're right. When they were because, kids. Yeah. And they got together, and they uh, actually, they got, this, uh, they got this one manager that really pushed them. His name was Jim Gribble. Uh, uh, yeah. He pushed them a long way. And uh, after that, I started singing with uh, another group called Sunny in the Spirals. And then after that, uh, I sang with another group called Seventh Avenue again. And uh, I could name some of the names in there, but that, that actually I grew up with that became pretty good stars, you know. Uh, and uh, then I started, then I was with the Clusters, the Tribunes. The Clusters had uh, had good hit had a, had a hit. And you were here with the Clusters. Darling, can't with me. you tell? Yes, yes, I was with you uh, when I was with the right. Clusters, right? And then I was with the Tribunes with Mike Cuomo and the Tribunes. Uh, and then I was with uh, a few other groups. I just keep on forgetting. Right. But now I'm with this great group that goes the time. Okay. Well, what it is is, and I think it applies to everybody here. It's the love of the singing. It's the love of the music. Right. Uh, it's not the money because no. <laughs> there, there, ain't, 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 there right. ain't no money you're out right, there. But, you're right. But uh, it's amazing the number of guys that are still singing and still going on. Yeah, I started when I was about 11 years old, back in the early 60s, and uh, I used to play all those 45s all day long, stacks. And uh, I grew up listening to the groups like the Moon Glows and the Hop Tones. And then I was on this group, the Candells, and uh, I sang with uh, Too Smooth, Freddie Amorosa, and uh, and then we got into uh, Still Around, and then I joined this group. It's a great group. That goes the time. Yeah. Joe, how about you? I started I'm originally from uh, Washington Heights in Manhattan, in New York, and uh, hung out with a bunch of guys. We started singing on street corners and subways and all the rest of it. Up in uh, Frankie Lyman and Teenagers Territory of George Washington High School. Mm -hmm. Sang with a group called Latin 4 Plus 1. 
Guess who? You were the plus one. <laughs> I was the plus one. <laughs> you were the plus one. I was the plus one. We sang for a while, you know, locally and everything else. And then, uh, then I joined Uncle Sam's Navy in uh, that station in Key West, Florida, and hooked up with a group down there called the Chambrays, and we did all the, the shows and everything. Then I come out of the Navy, and I was away from it for a while, and started going to UGHA, hooked up with a bunch of people up there, and uh, eventually formed uh, Magic Moments with my beautiful wife and... Uh, we sang together for probably 21 years, 22 years. And then uh, eventually everybody went their own way. And uh, I know Billy for mm, got to be 25, 27 years now, yeah. something like that. We used to sing at Lead East. And uh, and I got the call. Uh, they were looking for a baritone, and I decided to yeah, jump Led, in. Lead East is one of my favorite spots. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, going there for you, almost you, you 28 years. You can't see a show like you see yeah, there. Absolutely. Yeah, incredible. Yep. So I've been with these guys uh, about five or six years now, right, Billy? Yeah. Yeah. Billy, how about you? Uh, uh, do you really want to hear about it? Okay. <laughs> uh, I started in, I grew up in Jersey City. Uh, I went to high school with uh, two of the original, two original Duprees, Joey Santolo and Mike Yarnone. And, um, They're both deceased now. Yes. Yeah. And um, I had uh, a group uh, hanging around the C CYO in a Catholic church in Jersey City, and uh, we had a group called the Valentones. And uh, we even tried out for Ed Max uh, Amateur Hour. Um, That's an oldie but a goodie. Yeah. Then uh, years went by. I just uh, got away from the music. And then uh, I, st I heard about Led East. And uh, that's where I met Joe again, he, he said. And uh, there used to be, like, in the lobby, a lot of, you know, makeup groups getting together and singing. And, uh, and I know Joe and uh, some of his group members from Magic Moments uh, kind of was weaning me into with the bass singing and stuff, uh, Bill Ferenzano, right, uh, Joe? Yep. Bill, Billy, bass singer. Big bopper. And uh, now, uh, you know, I got really into it. I was with a group called Memories of You for about eight years, and uh, then uh, Sal and I, Sal Vital, started this group, Echoes of Time. And uh, in the interim, uh, through uh, BJ Jones, he was singing with the the, dubs. the the Persuasions and the Dubs. Right. Well, he was supposed to sing with Tony Milton and, and, uh, and the Willows. And uh, he couldn't make it uh, this one day. And uh, he asked uh, a friend of his, Ron Ruggiero, to call me to see if I would try out uh, to fill in for him. So I tried out, and Tony says, I want you as my bass. So I've been with him for like six years. Uh, also got a call with, from Kid Kyle to sing with him. I've been singing with Kid Kyle for about almost three years. And, um, you know, there's groups. I sing with Elmo. I, I sing with Warren. All kinds of uh, professional guys that's been on your show. The you expressions. Sing. I sing with Jimmy Faluca yeah. as a bass for uh, going on uh, two years. And uh, it's been a, a good ride for me. And, uh, you know, we just got done last Friday. We, the group sang in Hope Hug, Long Island. At a big uh, concert, Eisenhower Park. Eisenhower Park. Did 15, Eisenhower Park. That, that is some venue. Fifteen thousand people. It's incredible. Yeah. Out there. Yeah, and we, good time, yeah. we were there with the Passions, the Fireflies, and um, uh, Dimensions, and Kit Kyle, of course. And I sang with him and the group, and it was a great time. And uh, you know, like I said, this has been a good ride for me. Mm. That, that's nice when you get a venue that big. I, I know. On Staten Island, and, and I'm going back 20-something years, before the political figures did Back to the Beach down at the beach, uh, I did a show which we called Back to the Beach, and it was with Vito Pacone, and we had five or six groups, and we got that that, that one show, the very first show, we got 15,000 people. They had a close on Capitano Boulevard. It was uh. so crowded, and it came as a surprise to everybody, but... The word spread like wildfire, and it is nothing greater than to look out and see an audience that right. big. It's really stimulates you Absolutely. and it gets you going. Absolutely. Back to Carlos. Carlos, tell us. Oh, oh I'm sorry. We didn't mean to wake you. <laughs> tell right, us my about your Carlos career. Vasquez. Uh, I sang with a couple of groups: uh, the Four Pops, uh, the Gold Tones, the Expressions. I also have a band besides this group. Uh, we're more into. Uh, Modern stuff, Infinity. You've been here on a show with Infinity. Yeah. You did a great job, too. Yeah, thank yeah. you. 
Don't forget the clusters. Oh, the clusters. Uh, you know, you've, your, well, mind, your mind just forgets. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, listen, is there any place that the group's going to be in the near future, uh, Bill? We're going to be at Let East. Uh, we'll be, uh, I'm sorry, we're going to be at Let East uh, September 3rd on a Sunday. That's uh, Parsippany Hilton. Yes, yeah, Parsippany Hilton. And then, you know, we do, we're doing the, the Roadhouse. We're, we're going to be doing and Joe Broadway. We have a 40th anniversary. Yeah. yeah. We've got a 15th, 40th anniversary uh, uh, party we're going to be doing in, uh, in Staten Island at you the Staten. Joe Broadway also? And Joe Broadway. Yeah. When is yeah. that going to be? Well, a date, date is pending. Well, anybody just check the web website, you'll see where they're going to be. I know you do a lot of private, uh, private stuff, gigs. Private yeah. stuff. Yeah. Which is a good thing. Private mm -hmm. parties always good. You know, the weddings, and right. you get the and weddings, the anniversaries, and you know, and you know you got a group of people that are into this music mm -hmm. exactly. and they want yeah. you there. Right, so we'll call us. Your favorite all-time song and a group. Uh, my group would have to be uh, Smokey Robinson. I was so uh, I was always into Smokey. I used to sing a lot higher when I was younger. My favorite song, uh, You Can Depend On Me. How about you, Bill? Well, when I was young, I, was, I always loved the passions that, that they sang. And uh, I loved that song, This Is My Love, uh, by Jimmy Gallagher and them guys. And it turns out, as a, as a kid, I used to listen to it. Now I'm really good friends with Jimmy Gallagher, so we we on the same shows a lot. Is he back so. up here? Or is he down in Florida? Doing He's in Florida. Florida. He was here Friday was with Florida. us, and then uh, he went back to Florida. He lives in Fort Lauderdale. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Me personally, I think uh, as far as vocally, uh, Johnny Meister, I think was one of the the greatest lead singers uh, oh, that I've heard of, you know, in a long, yeah. long time. I'm also very passionate about the Spaniels, Pookie Hudson, in the group, you know. Well, well Fard's uh, favorite song, Golden Teardrops, maybe. maybe you just named ones. two things that are very special to me. Yeah, really? Yeah. Oh. yeah. Uh, I mean, num number one, my favorite song, and you, you guys did it, and, and, and I thank you for doing it, was uh, Peace of Mind. Peace of Mind. Yeah. Pookie Hudson is my favorite group yeah, of no all question. time, the no Spaniels, with, uh, just a super great human Absolutely. being. And, uh, it really the, was. The music he did was you know, phenomenal. He won the best yeah. bass singers around too. Yeah, Gerard. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Gerard Gregory. Yeah. Unfortunately, he, he yeah, too was best. Yep. Uh, was that a dig, Joe? No, that was uh, <laughs> uh, that was a left-handed compliment. <laughs> okay, Tony, how about you? Yeah. Well, one of my favorite uh, songs was um, "There's a Moon Out Tonight." The Capris, right. a favorite of mine, and uh, I liked all of uh, the Earl songs with Larry Chance. I used yeah. to play them a lot. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. He just did something new, and it's it's online. Uh, Gloria, he did a ver his version of Gloria, and yeah. Yeah. Uh, fantastic song, fantastic. I mean, if you go online, you see Larry Chance uh, in Facebook. Uh, there's a button you just hit, and they, they play for you. Did a great job on it. Joe, your turn. Uh, I have to say, uh, the flamingos. Mm. Absolutely. Uh, so there's a few songs on there that I like. Well, I like, uh, you know, I Only Have Eyes For You, uh, Where or When. Mi mm Amore. -hmm. Uh, Mi Amore. I like all the songs. I have the album home and I listen to it constantly. Yeah, yeah. It's amazing the way that sticks with you. Yeah. Yeah. Now you, now you mentioned the flamingos and you mentioned the moon glows. As a kid, I, I was a, a, an avid collector of. Um, 45s and I had one copy I had one side had secret love the moon glows and the flip side was golden teardrops the flamingos mm -hmm. okay I, I had people that would have killed me to get that record it was incredible to have that you know I believe it. sure and it was, it was beautiful well we got to get back to singing in a few seconds but uh, once again tell us how does somebody get in touch with the group well, you could call, uh, my number is 973-896-3720. Uh, That's Bill Prawn. And you also can reach us uh, on uh, our website. It's uh, theechoesoftime.com. And also Facebook. We're on Facebook. Just uh, Echoes of Time, key that in, and uh, you'll see uh, all the information. And 
uh, contact numbers and stuff. Yeah. Well, I want to thank you guys for coming. And I'm going to ask you now, you know, if we can come back again uh, in the near future, because we waited a long time to get the group in here, and under the circumstances, there was no options. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and I know that everybody wanted to get in here, and we finally got it done. And, and I'm so thankful that we did do it. Okay, uh, so keep that in mind. And come back uh, in the near future, and thank you so thank much you for very being much. here. Thank you for having us. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Pleasure, thank you. All right, now you're watching Echoes of Time, and like I said in the beginning of the show, connoisseurs of doo Okay. So you just don't change the channel because they're coming right back at you before you can blink your eye. Oh, oh. Do, 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 do. There she goes. Do, 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 do. Bye.
why don't we fall in love right from the start? You're the girl I'm really love. Oh, can't you see me? You're the only girl for me. As 
सा है सूरत guys you were great you did a fantastic job I, I can't thank you enough we had to wait a couple of years for you guys to come on with all of the things that went on uh, but it was well worth the wait because you guys are fantastic okay uh, okay you've been watching Island Hop we love you for watching Island Hop echoes of time if you see them out there go and see them in the show because believe me they're gonna make it well worth your while they can entertain, and they know how to do it. Greatest harmony I've heard in a long time. Uh, you just keep watching Island Hop, and I want to thank my crew. I want to thank, in the control room, Rosemary, Terry, Roman on audio. Uh, out here on camera, we got Mark, and we got JR, and we want to thank everybody for being on crew with us today. You keep watching Island Hop. We love you for watching, and we'll bring you another show next month. Everything that I try to do. Everywhere that I run to. I guess I'm alone. Everywhere he goes, he drops, follow me, he drops, follow me.